Yes. Okay, okay, I'm pretty excited. Let's pretend we're in Japan, guys. Is that my plane? Do you guys even know where I'm going? I haven't taken a plane in eight months since March. I have not gotten into an airport. I have not taken a, a flight. This is kind of crazy, new experience. And I kind of want to embark you on that journey of capturing, documenting that. So I'm going to do another challenge just to push my creativity here from this point right here all the way to the end of this terminal we're gonna try to take as many good photos as possible i'm gonna try to put you on a pov style and if you're wondering yes this is rush hour and it feels awfully quiet i've been to another terminal there was absolutely no one uh, but i think as a photographer that's gonna be a great opportunity to document those times how travel might have changed so if you're ready let's get started we're gonna go a7 3 24 millimeter and 85 millimeter on the ASMS3, let's get started. Woo. All right, here we go. So I'm on the 24 millimeter F14 and everything you're gonna see is obviously edited because I don't know, you guys keep asking if it's edited or not. And yes, it's edited with my presets. So here's what we're gonna do. Over there, we've got like this really cool rail with the people going all the way in. I think it's gonna make it for great symmetry. Right now, we're gonna try to get the ambience here was like people boarding i don't know if we're gonna do anything oh i kind of like that reflection Ooh, with that guy waiting over there a kind of multi-layered shot Let's see if we can do even better oh i kind of like that let's see dun, dun, dun. can we so i'm warming up right now i have kind of no clue what i'm gonna do yet but but i do like what I'm seeing so I'm gonna try to play a little bit with the reflection and it's so weird guys because I took a flight from Chicago earlier and there was literally no one in that flight it's like I had rented the whole plane for myself which is fun but you know it changes really compared to what I'm used to those shots might be better at like 85 millimeter that's right but if we go over there or even here this one maybe we'll get something here there was a guy the reflection of the guy was pretty cool i don't know if we can get another person to pass by <laughs> all right so this is not going to be on the bike like running obviously but i do have not to miss my flight which is fairly soon so <laughs> don't want to miss it but it's so weird because there is no one right so i can't even like get people in that shot which would be great it's just a pure symmetry yeah, exercise playing. here uh, this is what's happening outside what if we try to get some 85 millimeter shots of the planes like kind of lined up like that boom up and then uh, i don't know this those shots look kind of boring like to be honest this guy is not so interesting it's super hazy because of the fires um, so not much maybe this guy waiting mm. if we can layer things oh people going down people going down let's try to get it here we go so that's slightly more interesting than when there was no one boom all right got this now we're gonna continue if we can get anything at 85 here this guy over there looks pretty cool so that's on the asms3 um i wish we had better reflection here so we can get the guy but i don't really see his face now can you guys see his face i can't maybe manual focus there we go yeah that we need a polarizing filter for that shot. It doesn't come out too well otherwise. All right, let's see. I don't know if we shoot from here. Boom, someone waiting, face mask on. This is fun. This is gonna be fun. All right, so we've got the whole corridor to ourselves. Look, there's no one. How strange is that? I mean, if you guys have been in airports, you know what I'm talking about. Oh, maybe using that thing and getting the pilot over there F 
for those of you who remember the episode I did in the airport in Chicago like a long time ago it was fun and what I used to do is I would get shots of people like with some motion blur so let's try this so let's say I'm gonna shoot at like slow share speed and just like that maybe even slower just like that but literally there is no one now so it's kind of weird <laughs> it's like the most boring like photography ever like you have no subjects the shops closed i mean maybe that's interesting to capture you know shops closed let's go let's try that okay let's not say it's boring it just means i didn't find anything yet oh please don't worry dude that's kind of cool oh i like that it's really well framed nice uh and there's no and then the thing is closed so it's kind of dope now we've got that one let's try can we do anything i mean it's cool but we need someone all right someone with the orange jacket over there and i can't go back so i have to get all my shots now and not come back so let's see how that's gonna work can we get any cool frames like through the plants let's see because that guy in orange is like popping clearly popping hmm. i don't think it's a great super interesting shot but you gotta have some fun and so no one's going on the ramp to do something a little creative here don't know if it worked out oh i cannot oh i love it i love that shot it's so clean absolutely love that all right this is great this is great all right now we need we need to get it over here with some people if they take if they take it it's gonna look epic yep Let's try it from a higher angle, maybe. To help reduce the spread of the virus that causes COVID-19, a facial covering must be properly worn at all times at SFO. Please also practice physical distancing, keeping the other for six feet between you and the others at all times. Hey, let's try at 85. What do you guys think? 25 millimeter can we still get those people over there orange guy hmm no it's not gonna work out all right what about this one what about this guy like right there super low to the ground yeah not that great what do you think oh actually i do like the reflection of the different colors of light and the in the top ceiling so that's cool now let's see what we have here uh, we've got more people waiting so we can play with the how do you call that reflections dun, dun, dun. this is turning out to be way more fun than i thought i mean not that i thought it was boring but there isn't much much happening and the airport is, isn't that stylish so you do wonder like what am i gonna get right well it doesn't really matter how good the airport looks what matters is are you focused on getting a good shot or not let's try to get a panning shot of that lady passing by at like 
Let's try 120th of a second in that background. And we'll use a frame. So let's see. Is that gonna work out? Yes! Not bad, not bad. Okay, okay, I'm pretty excited. This one is not bad. I mean, it's pretty well framed. Uh, nice. What else are we gonna do? Oh, fun times, guys. Fun times. All right, this is cool too. One guy passing by on the kind of minimal. No, actually, there's more. Um, let's see. Oh, that lady going down. It's kind of tight frame here nah, not so interesting no offense ah, what's that? plane? is it my plane? do you guys even know where I'm going? guys, if, if you can guess try to guess in the comments oh, I like guys oh, this would be perfect if we could go a little bit to the right and have that H aligned but I don't think it's gonna happen because I can't move the plane, but still a fun shot right now. And usually you can see the pilots. Right now you can't. But they have that weird coating on the window which makes it look less appealing. This is gonna be like a 20 minute challenge because I have to board soon. Uh oh. Uh oh. I know one. I kind of like that guy alone there. We need a better frame. I hope I don't look too weird and don't get arrested either. Oh, he's facing the wrong way. Dang it. Let's get this guy over there. Let's make him disappear by the window. Boom. All right. Can we do anything with this? All right, what else? I kind of wish we had models. I think we can play with the escalator in the middle in the central area which could look kind of cool but right now we've got no one so oh look at that this is pretty fun if we're like fully centered i don't think it looks great at 85 to be honest it's way too tight no it doesn't come out well it's it's okay it's not super interesting okay let's one, try one more though don't abandon until you're really dissatisfied with your idea, okay? Three, two, one. Three, two, one. Here we go. This should be better. Yeah, that's okay. There is nothing to go home. Like we're not gonna open a gallery with that one. That's for sure. <laughs> right. Kind of like this guy. I'm kind of reading. Um, I'm gonna try to get their hands when they're trying to. Oh, this is funny. Oh, could have had my frame a little better, but it was kind of fun when. She put it in her mouth, but there was a mask, so she couldn't eat it. <laughs> That's hilarious. Love it. Then what else do we have here? Okay, we've got this. Oh, let's see if we can get something with the... The light is pretty good in here. So let's see. Dun, dun, dun. Guys, this, this could be literally titled most boring photo shoot ever, but you're still able to get some good stuff, so... And it's a question of perspective.
Um, oh, F11, whoopsie. It's not my intention, sorry. Oh, that guy, that guy is super interesting. All right, let's try 24 mil and then we're gonna arrive at the end. It's gonna be kind of... Okay, this one's gonna... I'm gonna do slow shutter speeds for everything. It's just gonna make everything a tad more interesting, okay? So 0 0.4 seconds. All right. One second. Let's see if we can do that. Handheld. Handheld, one second. Ready? Three, two, one, boom. Oh, I'm moving. I think I moved. I think I definitely moved. But it's still cool. Still cool. I think we can bring out some interesting colors here. Um, that thing is kind of ruining the frame, but let's try to go on the other side, though. Oh, you see the guy preparing the sushi? If we can get his face lit up perfectly, that can be a great shot. Oh, this is the kind of shit you want to crop in after. Let's pretend we're in Japan, guys. <laughs> I feel super rusted to like change environment. I've been in Chicago for like eight months, so feel super rusted to try something a little different oh there we go oh no that's better no that's my focus no no damn it you for real oh god damn it i keep missing my focus this guy looks so good let's try to get this oh Totally ruined the frame. Okay, let's try a little further. <laughs> Ooh, this one works. This one works. So pumped. All right, let's see what else there is. We can get more silhouettes shots, I think. Oh, I love that one. This guy is like literally waiting. He just took a selfie. Hey, how are you? Okay. Do you want a photo of you? Oh no. You sure? I can take a photo for you. Okay, sure. Yeah? I saw you, so I'm like, what do you want? What kind of photo? Just whatever you think is the best. Anything is <laughs> or, the best? Or right here. You want with the plane? Yeah, sure. Cool. I'm a plane freak. Oh, really? Nice. All right, let's see. Boom. Oh, one sec, you're in timer. Let me remove that. Here we go. It's all right, nice, looking good. And then let's get a little more plain. Um, yeah. Ooh, that's cool. I like that. We get a little bit of the plane, but the angle I, f I find is pretty cool. Right, thank you. You like it? Yeah. Cool, enjoy, man. Have a good day. Oh, why am I in manual? Why am I in manual? I that totally I totally ruined that shot. It's okay, we'll try again. Got nothing else to do. Some of the shots you will see are probably gonna be heavily cropped, even on a 20, 12 megapixel because and I'm not gonna like print them for like a gallery or anything so it doesn't matter if I end up with only 8 megapixels right 
Uh, let's see what else. I think we're reaching the end, guys. Let's see if we can get some cool shots still. Uh, let's see, what is that? Good, a good reflection on the floor. Uh, it's kind of boring, but why not? Why not? Oh, we can go outside. Let me check the time for my flight. All right, let's try to get that girl like drinking there. Maybe we'll get a silhouette. So that's kind of cool, but missing something. Here, now you can frame. Okay, a little boring. What about the coffee? With the lamp, boom. Kind of like the lamp. Very neat. Ooh. Wanted to capture the interaction. Alright, let's see what's outside guys. Woo! So pumped. Alright. People working. Maybe that person over here. If it's the same pilot as earlier, that's pretty neat. I kind of love those flowers. Can we get just texture? I did not expect that, but let's try. If we can get some texture here uh, with the 24, it's gonna be awesome. Let's see, here's a kind of shot, guys, you might never see, but if you want to make backgrounds, those are like absolutely dope. So you just go like super close you can go super shallow if you want i don't recommend going too shallow but go super close and just shoot the textures like that like you get in it get in with your camera boom just like that love it here look at that screenshot for textures it's pretty cool all right i don't want to miss my flight so i think i'm gonna take two last ones let's make sure they're good ones but i kind of want to get like that ambience because it's kind of surreal like that desert like those plants with the background i don't know is there anything interesting No. No. Ugh. Not gonna work. Not gonna work. All right, let's try again. Let's try again. Let's try something else. If we shoot inside while the door is closed, what happens? Huh, nothing, nothing great happens. <laughs> That's what happened. Uh, all right. Oh, all right. This was, this was, oh God. This was a, a great and terrible idea at the same time, guys. I'm absolutely sweating right now and I'm hot and I, I'm already stinky after one flight and not even the second one. Let me know which ones were your favorite shots. Let me know what you kind of think about it. Again, uh, here we're not trying to create art for a gallery. We're really trying to just having fun. You know, I'm just trying to have fun and I'm also trying to like train, training. This is training, meaning you get in difficult environments and you try to do interesting things. That way when you're in great environments, well, you're not struggling to find the right shots, yeah? It gets a lot easier. Okay, so love the 2414 as usual. 85 is, uh, that's the two lenses I recommend to anyone. 85, 24, that's it. Your life is perfect now. I'll see you in the next episode. Guess down below where we're going. Oh, and for those who don't know, everything's edited with the presets. I keep saying it, but people keep asking, so link down below if you want to grab them. See ya.